on the top of the pops. This is disgusting, and I'll let him explain. Really? Many, many years ago, I was in, involved with a, a certain television personality that allowed me access into the BBC. And I used to be able to get onto a very famous program called Top of the Pops. And a lot of the girls would say to me, Charlie, Charlie, get me on Top of the Pops. And I could take probably five or ten girls on a week. And I said, well, I'll take you on, but you'll end up having to shag the bloke that, you know, he'll probably want to shag. And they were like, no problem, no problem, we come, we come, you know. Yeah. And not there was never a problem. Right. Now, 30 years on... Dave knows. And then their marriages are in their 50s and 60s. It's suddenly become a problem. It wasn't a problem all those years ago. Right, right, exactly. And I remember exactly. these girls saying, I'm quite happy to come there. So I'm, I'm very, very careful. Now, there is a lot of bad things what going on. What were those age numbers there. again? And there was bad things going on there because a lot of these and girls they... were young girls, you know. Um, mm. And back in the sort of 80s, you, I didn't think anything of it. Well, bad things going on there because a lot of these and girls run that were young girls, you know. Bad things going on there because a lot of these and girls run that were young girls, you know. Bad things going on there because a lot of these and girls run that were young girls, you know. You get shagged, as he put it. So you're a man that admits trafficking young children onto men on top of the pops. If you've got to use their following to try and push your narrative forward, then you must be doing something wrong.